Half a cup of vinegar twice a day. Better than any medication out there. Want some? No, I'm good, thanks. Uh, hey, did you see some leftover Thai food in here? I was saving it for lunch. Oh. <laughs> Threw it out. Got enough chemicals, enough salt, enough preservatives, enough MSG to kill a water buffalo. Yeah, um... <clears throat> okay, look, Eduardo. I know this is a difficult situation for both of us, but uh, irregardless of that, I, I think it would be helpful if we set some ground rules right off the bat. What do you think? <sighs> regardless. What? You meant regardless, or maybe irrespective. But there's no such word as irregardless. Thanks, Eduardo. I thought we already paid the property tax. No, nah, no. Nah. That one was for last year. This one is for this year, which we didn't pay because we needed the money for the mortgage. All right. Well, we'll figure it out. We always do. We'd be fine if I could just finish my novel. How'd it go today? Before the polka music or after. Dad? Yeah. He's either standing over me correcting my spelling or dumping through the house criticizing my dietary habits. Oh, he's just lonely, yes, honey. Yes, yes. It's been five years since Mom died, but I know he still misses her. I know, I know, I'm sorry. I totally get it. Mm -hmm. But babe, I'm a writer, okay? And I can't write <laughs> if I have to babysit your dad. Hey. <laughs> mm. I just got an idea. Mm. Why doesn't he invite some friends over here tomorrow? Wait, seriously? Yeah. What, you want me to take care of a house full of Eduardos? No, that's the point. They take care of each other. They keep each other company so you can get back to work. Mm. What mm. do you think? Shulabab. <laughs> Read them and weep. Straight to the king. <laughs> Arno is already showing a flush. A straight beach of flush. You're full of crap. What are you yelling for? We're playing for matchsticks. We're crying out loud. Okay, we got you all set up. Snacks, beer in the fridge. Gabe, what difference does it make? It makes a difference in principle. A straight beach of flush, right, Arnold? Only when it's a straight flush. And there, sir, that's it. He's right. You guys are cheaters. You're just a bunch of cheaters. Hey, hey. You can't say that. I'm a certified public accountant, and we never cheat. Have fun. Ah, poker. I wondered what I was going to be doing until I died. All right, baby. Yes, sir. Where's your John? Gabe. John. Okay. Down the hall, first door on the left. Blood is on his last legs. work this thing. Never mind that thing's bad for the environment anyway. I brought old Betsy. So, what's the deal on that, Eddie? I thought you didn't even like your son-in-law. What are you doing living in his house? Uh, well, they were having kind of a rough time. And asked me to move in and help out a bit. That's a good thing. Yes, multi-generational families can be very rewarding. 
wait until the first time you forget where you put your milk, and then they find it in your sock drawer. Never get a reward for that. Whoa! Hey, Frank! Lights went out! Arnold. See you later, Pimpadrill. All right, my man. <laughs> Be good. Walter. Uh, ciao. Ciao, Bella. All right, Gabe. Take it. Wait for me in the car, Dad. I'll be right there. Oh, Frank. Thank you so much for watching Dad all day. That's no problem. I can tell that he had a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. I was wondering if maybe he could come back again sometime soon. Uh, well, you know, Denise, this was kind of a one-time thing, you know, I don't, I'm not sure if we're gonna make it a regular event, well, I mean... I could help with the expenses. No, no, I mean, that's not necessary. Here, please, you would be doing me a huge favor. Here, at least take a hundred. The senior home no. charges three hundred. Three hundred dollars per person? Per day. You don't say. No, no, I mean, we could fit like a dozen or so people in the house at once. I mean, if we charge a hundred bucks a day... Okay, well, you want to bring 12 people into our living room? No, no, no. Not people, Emma. Clients. I don't know, Frank. It's a lot of work taking care of senior citizens. Oh, Lord, you're the one that said that they could take care of each other. Well, what do I know about senior citizens? I'm a high school teacher. Uh, hey, Dad, <sighs> can I talk to you for a sec? Not right now, Jordy. Your mom and I are discussing something. It just sounds like you're arguing. Don't you have homework? Thanks, Dad. <sighs> the truth is, we need the money. Let's just try for one week. What do you say? Hello? Hi, Denise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Frank Collins we met the other day. Yes, exactly. How are you? Good, good. Listen, Denise, how would you like a place to put your dad? I sure did. about something. Well, can it wait, Jordan? I'm a little busy right now. Excuse me. Had breakfast yet? Uh, I'll get something at school. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Your body is a machine. You gotta keep it fueled up. Here, homemade granola. I always keep a couple handfuls in my pocket, just in case. Thanks, Grandpa. Hey, what are you doing? Well, I, I, it was so nice having your friends over the other day. I thought maybe we'd invite some more. I don't have any more friends. Not yet. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Come on in. Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Cash or check is appreciated. Of course, we prefer cash, but we're not picky. Hello. Nice to meet you. Hey, how are you? All right. Good to see you. Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you.